Modern conditions of war have emphasized the enormous importance of radioelectronic warfare and the need for their miniaturization, which indicates that relying only on powerful complexes on a mobile chassis is no longer enough. Thus, as early as 2023, the Pentagon began a large-scale field study devoted to this problem. Although the details of this study remain secret, it becomes known about certain practical actions, the delivery of wearable EW systems to the U.S. Army in a short time. The first copies should be delivered to the main training bases of the Army, and then to each combat brigade of the ground forces for personnel training. The terms of the first stage are six months and have a higher priority, the center of advanced research in the field of cybersecurity, which is part of the Army and specializes in training specialists and modernization of communication and communication systems. What specific system will be supplied to the American eyelash remains unknown, but it is known that the wearable complex, placed in a backpack, is intended for use by two fighters. It is important to note that in English terminology, the issues of electronic warfare and electronic intelligence are combined under a single term, electronic warfare. Therefore, the task of the operators of such a wearable complex will be not only the analysis of the radio spectrum to detect threats, but also the creation of obstacles. It is interesting that the deployment of such EW assets in the U.S. Army is happening quickly, and the implementation time for such a structure as the U.S. Army is very tight. Moreover, the mass production and saturation of brigades will occur in parallel with the training and integration of new capabilities at the lower infantry level. Like, comment, subscribe to the channel.